The acting bug bit Kenneth Williams when, as a student, his English teacher suggested he try out for a school play. He found that he enjoyed it tremendously, but when he raised the possibility at home of becoming an actor, his father forbade it. Williams was eventually sent to art school in London in 1941. In 1944, he was drafted into the army, and although posted to the Royal Engineers, he managed to land a job in the Combined Services Entertainment Unit, where he got a chance to act in shows that were put on to entertain the troops, and even design the posters that advertised the shows. After his discharge from the army he began to work as a professional actor, and traveled the country in repertory companies. It was in a production of, St. Joan, where he played the Dauphin, that a radio producer saw him and hired him to do voice characterizations on a popular radio comedy show, Hancock's Half Hour. His penchant for wild, off-the-wall characters led to his being hired by the producers of the, Carry On, comedy series, where he performed in 26 entries in the long-running series. When the series ended, Williams returned to radio work, and also made the rounds of the TV talk shows in addition to writing several books, including his autobiography. Later in his life Williams developed a serious ulcer, and was given medication to combat the pain. On April 15, 1988, he was found dead in his bed. It was determined that in addition to his regular pain pills, he had apparently taken some sleeping pills the night before, and the combination of those and his regular medication proved fatal.